Okay, so when the Son of Man comes, when the Son of Man comes in His glory, and all His angels with Him, every last one, He'll sit on His throne, His glorious throne, and all the nations will be gathered around Him. Oh, the Son of Man, all the angels, all the nations. Yep, and He's going to separate them. The angels and the nations? No, the people. He'll celebrate. He'll separate the people on his left and on his right. Oh, like a shepherd. Yes. Like a shepherd separates the sheep from the goats. <laughs> He'll put the sheep on his right oh, and the goats on his left. The goats on his left. Oh. <laughs> then. The king will say to those on his right, Come, Come, you who are blessed, by my father. Just leave the hats on. As I was saying to those on my right, on my right. Oh. Come, take your inheritance, the kingdom prepared for you since the creation of the world. For I was hungry and you gave me something to eat. I was thirsty and you gave me something to drink. I was a stranger. You were a what? A stranger and you invited me in. I needed clothes. You needed clothes. Yes, and you clothed me. I was sick and in prison and you came to visit me. Hold the phone. You were in prison? Lord? What are you talking about? When did I see you hungry or thirsty or a stranger or... Uh, what was it again? Naked. Yeah, naked. Or, or sick or in prison and come visit you. I mean, I've been to the prison. I would have seen you there. They were detaining Jakub and Fatima until their papers came in August. I was at their prayer meetings twice a week getting updates on their asylum status. We were so scared it wouldn't go through. It was lonely in there. I know. And you wouldn't believe how little they fed them. I had to bring them money for the canteen or they would have starved. I know. And it was so cold. Those thin cotton jumpsuits, they were freezing until we brought them sweaters. And even No, then, no, those were great. I love alpaca wool. <laughs> Me too. Wait, you do? Okay, maybe next time we'll knit one for you. <laughs> Lord, <laughs> that's what I'm trying to tell you. You already did. Whatever you did for the least of my brothers and sisters, you did for me. The least of my brothers and sisters? Yakub. Yeah. Fatima. Mm hmm. Oh, so you're saying yeah, that was me. You. Whatever you did for the least of these brothers and sisters of mine, you did for me. <laughs> oh. My... Billy. Billy. Billy! What? Did you hear that? Uh, I'm kind of busy. Okay, remember that sweater I was knitting? That took you forever. Knitting is hard. Okay. Well, that was him. Wait, who? Him in the detention center. What are you talking about? I mean, I knew he cared about Jakub and Fatima. I knew they mattered to him, but all this time I thought he'd be, you know, up there with the angels and the glorious thrones, but... To those he was... on my left, on my left, oh. the goats on the left, depart from me. Like, go away? Depart from me. You are cursed. You must depart into fire. <laughs> into fire. Fire prepared for the devil and his angels. The devil and his angels. And goats? I was hungry and you gave me nothing to eat. Thirsty, nothing to drink. I was a stranger. Wait. Nothing. Naked. Nothing. Hold on. Sick and in prison and you I, did but... nothing. I was sick and in prison and you did not look after me. When were you ever any of those things? If I saw you hungry, thirsty, a stranger, naked, sick, in prison, I would have done something. I would have cared for you. Like you cared for Jakub? Hmm? Fatima? Who? They've been coming to your church since August. They sit in the third row, the refugees from Syria. Oh, them, right. I forgot their names. I know. But I've said hello, and I dropped off clothes. You dropped off stained clothes from the throwaway pile. Well, they were some... Goat. <laughs> yeah? You have brothers and sisters? A whole flock. Well, let's say your brother comes home and finds his house destroyed. His family is gone. 
The neighbors are gone. The town is ruined. He runs for the train station. Soldiers throw him down and beat him. And now he is bleeding and running until he gets to a train. He doesn't know where it is going, but he knows he must get out. He arrives in a city he does not know, among people he does not know, who speak a language he does not know. Those people take him to a prison and tell him he must wait. Goat, do you want someone to take care of your brother, your sister, in this terrible place? Yeah, of course. Well, we moved into the building at the end of your block. That place? Every time I walk by there, I mean, what are they cooking? Well, we try to make it taste like home. Who is we? Yakub and Fatima. So you mean they? No, we. I don't understand. Yakub and Fatima, my family, I'm with them. We're a we. But the angels, the glorious thrones, I mean, aren't you supposed to be? With these brothers and sisters of mine, I am. You saw them and you did nothing. I'm telling you, whatever you did not do for my brothers and sisters, you did not do for me. Lord. Depart. <laughs> Depart from me.